Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. I don't need this fan. So it's like out of my way. How y'all doing? I'm currently watching the MTV Game Awards. I'm pretty sure that's either Olivia Rodrigo or Doja Cat. Olivia Rodrigo. Yes, I'm just now currently watching the VMAs. But... The reason I brought you all here today is because I'm going to be straightening my hair. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be straightening this grease mop. What girl damages her hair just for a YouTube video? Me, I do. But usually, when I post a YouTube video like this randomly out of like nowhere, it's because. I just like to talk to you guys, you know, it sounds weird, and I know, like, only a good amount of people watch my YouTube videos, but that's okay. I know only a few amount of people watch my YouTube videos, so I talk to them. That's heating up really quick. Uh, I do, but... Let me just like oh god. I'm gonna go get my comb. I will be right back. Okay, I'm back with my comb. First off, before we officially start anything. Like what I mean by like anything, I mean by like, you know, I have a sore right there. What do I have a sore right there? I have a sore on the top of my head. Mm. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, um, usually when I like to post YouTube videos is when something is happening in my life. And you know, something is happening this weekend. Um, especially with, like, spring break and everything. Spring break started, like, a couple days ago. Quite a few days ago, actually. It started, um, Friday when I got home. And, you know, spring break is spring break. It's just spring break. It's not really much of a big deal. But, you know, some people just are, like, completely different over spring break. You know, <laughs> hopefully y'all cannot hear that in the background, because if you can, um, copyright. <laughs> okay, my question is, was the VMA recorded before they got together? Well, before they broke up? Okay, main question, who the heck is Foo Fighters? And come for me in the comments, if you will. Of course, the one and only Dojo Cat is hosting the VMAs. Of course she is hosting the VMAs.
But yeah, I'm sorry for the silence. I'm like really concentrated for some reason. But um But yes. Um I have a very eventful weekend this weekend. Um yeah. My aunt, my grandmother, and my cousin are all coming over down to Florida. If you know, or if you do not know, I am originally from Ohio. When I lived in Ohio, the place that I lived at was Greenville. It was a extremely, like, small town, and no one know, knew who, what the heck Greenville even was, or where it was. Ooh, I almost just burnt my hand. Or where it was, or what, like, who lived in it? And now, like, I leave, and Springville is now currently a small ghetto town, where, ugh, it's just a lot. Springville is now currently a small ghetto town, um, where everything happens. And when I mean everything, I mean everything, girlies, like, girlies and guys. I mean everything. So, yeah, um, that is where, that's where, that's what got Olivia Rodrigo to her career. Was driver's license. Of course, it's dynamite with BTS. Of course, it goes to Olivia Rodrigo. That was weird. It was like a pebble right under my eye. I don't know if you could see it, but it was right under my eye. And I just popped it. I love her dress though. Her dress is phenomenal. A lot of people diss her for uh winning like the VMA Song of the Year award. But yeah, like I was saying, I, I'm a girl with ADHD, okay? ADHD is like constantly distracting me from everything. I talk about one thing and then I talk about another. But back to my aunt and my, my aunt, my grandmother and my cousin coming over. Um, yeah, they're coming down to Florida and, you know, it's going to be nice. It's going to be fun. It's going to be amazing because, yeah. It's just gonna be amazing. It's gonna be a good time. Yeah, well, that couple also broke up. Don't know why that couple broke up, but they broke up. Because, like, with rumors co with Camila Cabello and uh, Shawn Mendes going around, apparently he broke up with her because of her body. That's what I was hearing, or the fact that he is, like, gay. Like, I want to do something with my hair. But yeah, what I've been hearing on um, why they broke up was because like he was like gay or something, and everyone kept making assumptions that he was gay. That he was gay. And that's why he broke up with her or something. But 
and then there's like other rumors going on that he broke up with her because of her body. And I was confused about that. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm currently trying to watch the VMAs while putting up my hair. And it's not going to work. Oh, As you all know, I have curtain banks that I originally cut myself, and I'm going to do like actual banks, but not really at the same time. But I'm going to do, I'm going to do a, um, something I have already done before, but I have never showed you guys before so for my dad's either first or second for my dad's second football game I did a two piece in the front and a slick back ponytail and a slick back ponytail and it was adorable and I thought about doing that again I'm being completely honest. I have thought about that again. I will be right back. Are we doing even a hair tie? Um, hair girl. I paused it and we paused it and unpaused it. Okay, bye. So I'm back with my hair tie and my hair gel. And. I know this looks oh, looks extremely weird at the moment, but the aftermath, I promise you, is extremely freaking adorable. And like, this is one of my favorite hairstyles I have ever done. Like, ever. <laughs> And it's not like it's not very often. I actually do this to my hair. But like also here's the thing. I did this hairstyle like at least two or three times where when I first officially cut my hair. The last time I did this hairstyle, I put my ponytail to the side a little bit, and that's what I'm gonna do again. Is put my ponytail to the side a little bit to make it like pop out a little bit more. There we go. Tighten it up a little bit. See? To where it's like to the side a little bit, but it's also like to the side, and it's a little bit at the same time. This man just threw his ukulele to the crowd. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, but yes, my hair is, that part of my hair is completely 100% done. And then, I'm probably going to add like, two or three layers of hair gel to my hair. That one was not enough. Okay, here's the thing. Like, I go through hair gel like crazy. When I say like crazy, I mean like crazy. I go through hair gel like crazy. And it's insane. But, you know, that's what happens when you're in ROTC. You go through hair gel like crazy. Like, I put my... I put hair gel in my hair at least, like, 
how many Tuesdays are there in the month? Like, quite a few times each month. But yes, my hair is not completely gel down. I will wash my hands and I'll be right back. Okay, I have an evenly good amount of hair gel in my hair. My grandpa once told me that I looked like Cindy Lauper, and I was like, who the heck is that? And now, I look at it, and I look at her, and then I take a look at me, and I'm just like, I do not look like her. Okay, I often realize that this is too much hair. <laughs> I did that the last time. So I'm gonna section my hair a little bit. My hair is now currently in sections. So I did this the last time I put my hair up on a pony. I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. My, I need to redo my hair real quick. I usually put about that much gel, and this is the brand that I use. I use Suave X. I use Suave Max Hold, and the, and it's non-stick alcohol free. That is a lie because my hands get left completely 100% sticky. Get 100% sticky after I do this. Like all the time. Because I, like I said before, I use gel at least like once or twice a week, maybe. I forgot my dog is outside. I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. I washed my hands and I let my dog back in. But last time I tried doing, and there goes my hair straightener. She's fine and on. Um, but yeah, the last time I tried doing this didn't go very well. The curls turned out ugly AF. But I'm gonna try it again. I'll be right back after I do this. Bye. I'm back. So this is to hold the... See, look at this crap. <laughs> that is horrible. <laughs> That is pretty bad, actually. Like, who would want that in their face? so differently and they were together <laughs> see like they were together
Wait. Excuse me? But yeah, that is my hair. My hair looks phenomenal today. I like it. It looks gorgeous. Now I gotta get dressed and do my makeup. But yeah, I will see y'all later. Okay, so I found my eyeliner, but I can't find my mascara for some reason. Um. Oh, there's just a lot. I'm still currently looking for my mascara, but. I do have my eyeliner, and I might do that real quick while I'm on camera with you guys. Where's my eyeliner? My eyeliner is... Girls are like, I don't get how people do it on the waterline. I don't get it. Blah, blah, blah. It's so much hard. It's so hard. It's so difficult. Yes, it can be hard. It can be difficult. Yes, 100%. But you know what? Once you eventually get the hang of it... Once you eventually get the hang of it... It starts, you know... Start studying on me. Like this eye constantly turned out darker than this eye. But I will be right back because your girl's gonna find her mascara and then get dressed and finish this whole look. Love you, babies. Wait. Okay, so um, I cannot find my mascara literally anywhere. I'm gonna keep looking and I'm gonna finish this. Okay, I found my mascara. It took forever. <laughs> but yeah, I found it. Um. Yeah, I'm this is my favorite mascara. You can't see the label on it anymore because it rubbed off. But. This is, I'm pretty sure Big Daddy Mascara by, oh, I'm pretty sure it's by, oh, Matt. I don't remember where I got it. I remember where I got my eyeliner. That's a good performance though. It's my bad my hands are on her answer. I'm not gonna post this video. <laughs> I'm 
I'm editing out that last part. Call me by your name, Hit. Our makeup is done. I'm gonna go pick up my outfit. See ya then. Oh my god, I love his underwear. It peaked. Okay, I'm gonna go get dressed. Okay, I'm back. Why is that wet? That's probably from the sink. But I'm gonna fix my pants. And then I'm gonna show you all my fit. Fix my shorts. My hair looks phenomenal. My shirt is really freaking wet. So here is the fit. This is. There's not enough loop. Here's the shirt. And then here's the shorts. I'm not gonna show you the shoes because the shoes, the fit. <laughs> no, y'all thought I was gonna be wearing cute shoes? Yeah, Captain! Okay, this lip balm. It's phenomenal, but it's so sweet. I'll show you the brain in a second. My lips look extra shiny. Uh, so I'm gonna show you an unopened one. I'm sorry, I I'm the back of my lip. This is the brand. Not a sponsor. My mom just works at a printing company for this. It's, um, Sun Balm Lip Balm. Jesus. Lip Balm Coconut Flavor. It's also sunscreen. It's, it's for, um, 30 degrees. It's Bortz Spectrum. SPF 30 with owl, 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 owl and vitamin E. It's really good for your lips. Um, wouldn't recommend coconut. But we also have their uh, face stick. We have like two, three of those. I'm gonna show you guys those. I'm gonna show you what the face sticks look like so you, you can get some. Cause yeah, um, here's what they look like. This is the face stick. And this is what it looks like. If I can get the packaging open. That's not what I wanted. It's kind of stuck to the packaging. I will be right back. I'm getting my butt cake by sunscreen. Okay. So, here is the premium sunscreen face stick by Sunbum. It's 30, and it's 
Void Spectrum SPF 30, water resistant up to 80 minutes, and this is how much is in the stick. There's quite a bit in the stick. I'm not gonna just take it all up. There's a dog here on him. And it smells like vanilla. It smells amazing. It smells phenomenal. But yeah, that's the face stick. And here's what the box looks like. This is what the box looks like. This is what the box looks like. But yeah. Um, if you ever see it in the store, I haven't tried out the face stick yet, but I heard this is better than Banana Bow, and it's actually really cheap, and look what it says at the top, it's so cute, it says trust the bomb, and it's adorable, but yeah, if you go to the stores and stuff, you should totally get this, I haven't tried it out yet, but. It's a really good man. I have to go put this one back. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, yeah. But that's the Sundown brand. It's better than Banana Boat. But yeah. I personally felt like putting that out there. Because my mom's, they call me my mom works at, she prints on them, they print on them, and yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put that out here, okay? My looks are so glossy. Like, I put this stuff on with my original lip gloss, and it's perfect. Like, it's so glossy. But, yeah. Um, this is my longest YouTube video ever. If you watch this completely through, you are a true fan, and I love you. I love you. Um, yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say. But I wish you the best of luck in life. And with friendships, because friendships aren't always going to be forever. Some may, some may not. But you know, if those friendships that are not forever and you thought, those people were just swept away and said goodbye, bon voyage, bon voyage, bon voyage. I forgot how to say friends, okay? But if, like, you know, they just leave you. God made them leave you for a reason. Just remember that. Right now, I love you. Goodbye, my lovelies. Goodbye, my ladies and gentlemen. Have a nice life. Have fun. Also, yesterday, I forgot to post my shorts. What I was gonna have for dinner, and what I had for dinner was, give me one second which was this this is bottom of shepherd pie and um, it is um what kind of ground beef one chopped small onion one can of creamy mushroom which is the uh 10 ounce or three to four ounce um 16 ounces of drained canned corn um, shredded cheese as much as you like. Um, prefer to use instant potatoes and salt and pepper. But, yeah, I'm gonna see y'all whenever. Also, what I had for lunch today was, um, pizza rolls and some coffee, which. I'm not even done yet. This is my coffee from like this morning. It's extremely good and still somewhat slightly warm.
and beautiful artistic execution. I pray she's Team USA, but I think she prefers Planet Earth. Please give it up for Georgia Yeah. I'm going to continue watching these videos. Have a nice day. I love you all. Goodbye, my lovelies. Bye.